Hello everybody, today we're doing vegetable spaghetti bolognese. So it's big January and healthy just after Christmas. So hopefully this will be a good one for you to get back healthy and have a few vegetables in your diet. So this will actually give you four of your five a day vegetables. So we need 300 grams of carrots, which is three carrots roughly. It doesn't matter if you're just slightly off on your ingredients. 300 grams of leeks, which is about two leeks. 100, 150 grams of courgette, which is one courgette. And then I'm using chestnut mushrooms, but you can use any mushrooms you like, 200 grams of. Then I'm using whole wheat pasta because it's got more vitamin B in it and that's good for you. Tomato puree, a vegan oxo cube beef, but vegan, please make sure it's vegan. Soy sauce, black pepper, tin of tomatoes, tomato puree, and then this to go on top, which is vegan style grated like Parmesan cheese. The only place I've found that I can buy this is Lidl. So if you want to get this Lidl, if you don't want to go in Lidl and you can't get it anywhere else, we can just use normal grated vegan cheese to go on the top. Okay, so first of all, we're going to take our vegetables and we're going to prepare them. So we're just going to cut our courgette up. I'm going to cut it down the middle and then cut it down again so that when you cut it, you've got it in four pieces. And we're just going to cut it so you've got it in cube sized pieces. So we're then going to do our carrots. I'm not going to peel our carrots because most of your goodness is in the skin. So just wash them first and then we're just going to take the ends off them. And then again, we're just going to cut them down the middle. If they're really fat and you feel you want to cut them again, then cut them that way. And then when you chop them, you'll have nice sized pieces. So we're now going to take our mushrooms, which you've washed first. If they're really big ones, cut them in half and then we're just going to slice them up. And then lastly, we're going to take our leeks. Just cut the bottom off your leeks. Cut your leeks all the way down the middle. And then just take your outside layer off. And then just chop them up. We're using leeks instead of onions. They're just not quite as strong and they give it just a nice flavor. And cut all the way down to the end just leave the last inch don't cut that bit okay so we're now going to cook our vegetables so I've got a frying pan and I've got some olive oil in it first of all we're going to put the leeks in and just move them about in your oil so they get covered with oil because we're going to sweat the whole lot off then we're going to pop the carrots in And your mushrooms. And then our courgettes. And because we're being healthy and we don't want too much oil in it, I'm just going to put a couple of tablespoons of water in so there's a little bit of liquid so that we can sweat these off. We're now going to pop a lid on this and we're going to sweat these off for about 20 minutes. If you haven't got a lid, put a piece of tin foil over the top and that will work just as well. So this has now had 20 minutes to sweat off and you'll see that the vegetables have shrunk down quite a lot. So we're now going to add our tin of tomatoes. To say I'm using ones that have already been chopped up you can use ones that are not chopped up and chop them up yourself if you want to. I've then got two tablespoons of tomato puree. I've then got two tablespoons of tomato sauce plus a teaspoon of soy sauce. And stir those in. Then we're going to have some freshly ground pepper. And 
and then we're going to add our oxo cube which the best way to do an oxo cube is to crush it up in the packet so you don't get it everywhere and when it's all nicely crushed up just open your packet and you'll have crushed oxo but please make sure you get the meat free one the vegan one and then we're just going to put a little bit of water in the bottom of our can and rinse our juice out and add that to it as well and then we're going to leave that to cook for about half an hour till the sauce is reduced right down and you can either cover it with your lid or you can put your tin foil back on it now it's nice and bubbly and just leave it to cook away so we're going to take our boiling water and we're going to take our spaghetti and we're going to pop our spaghetti in and we're just going to let it cook so once your spaghetti is cooked we're going to take it out and we're going to pop it in a bowl So there we have our sauce, it's been cooking now for about 20 minutes to half an hour and you can see it's gone all nice and thick and reduced down and all your vegetables are all nice and cooked. So we're then going to take our pasta and we're going to pop some of our sauce on top. And then we're going to take some of our parmesan vegan cheese and we're going to sprinkle that over the top. And there you have a lovely healthy vegetable bolognese.